Josh. Yes, Daniel. Why are we standing here like this? You see that car? Of course I see that car. That's an empty car. We go mistake it for our car. We don't even have a car. Shut up. Follow me. Slow down. Dude, slow the hell down. <laughs> Great, thanks for that. <laughs> Not gonna lie, I was kinda hoping that was gonna be the outcome. Any reason you wanted to stop or did you just fancy a quick little break? Just shut the hell up and drive. <laughs> I bet you're glad that wasn't hot though. To be fair, I'm more worried about what we're doing. Look, we're in a stolen car, what are we gonna do? <laughs> if I ever let you down? Look, why don't we just pull over in a car park and talk about the situation that you somehow managed to put us in. I was kind of hoping you were going to say I need to get your permission to get some fast food, but I guess a car park will have to do for now, won't it? I never knew how cars had this many buttons. Do you know what this one does? No. I was kind of hoping she'd have some kind of CD or something. I guess we'll just start with the radio for now. <laughs> the wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. The wheels on the bus go Not really sure how I feel about this one. No, that was one of my favourite songs as a kid. It's weird how music can just make you feel even more hungry. Should we just go get some food? <laughs> Looks like you're getting this one. I just checked down the front of the seat or something. It's not my wallet, but I guess it'll do. Mm. That's good. Mm. It's probably the best free meal I've ever had. But we're just going to sit here all night. I'm actually glad you asked that. Mm -hmm. The one thing I know for sure is a woman love a guy that can drive. What do you know what women look for in men? Watch and learn, apprentice. Josh, what do you want? What do you definitely need? Oh, I was just me and a mate wondering if you wanted to come see our new car with us. Hello, Emma? Emma? Connection must have dropped. Pass the phone, you fool. Megan, it's uh, Josh's friend. Um, we were just wondering if you wanted to come chill with us in our brand new car. We're there. Do you want to uh, come to us or should we come get you? I live super close to that one anyway. I can just come to you. Okay, well, we'll be waiting. Cooler. Oh, 25 minutes. Maybe she got lost. Well, that's the only reasonable explanation, right? Or, or what? Well, she's just done us a dodging. She made us wait nearly 30 minutes for someone <laughs> who wasn't even coming. Talk about killing the mood, Dad. What do we do? This is kidnapped. We kidnapped a baby. I'm now officially a kidnapper. How can you be so calm about this? There is a baby in the car that you stole. Well, actually. <laughs> this is all your fault, you know that, right? Oh, this is such a mess, I knew this was a bad idea. Can you just shut up and calm down for five seconds? I'm just trying to think of a solution here. A solution? What possible solution could there be to this? I don't know. 
Beat's new parents, both Beat's dads. Men do it all the time, although to be honest, you're such a little girl. You'd make a great mum, to be honest. We're teenagers! We can't even look after ourselves, let alone a kid! Okay, okay. So, seeing as you're not keen on the idea of being a parent with me, which I find highly offensive, by the way. How about we just ditch the car, ditch the kid, and just find a way home? We'll just drive back to the police station. What, and be put in prison? Patience, I haven't finished. We'll just get out with the baby, leave it on the doorstep to the police station, leave the car on the curb outside of the police station, we'll just run away as free men who haven't stolen the car and accidentally stolen the baby as well. Simple. I mean, if you could hurry up with the thinking, that would be great. Well, seems like the only plan that could possibly work, so I guess we'll go with that one. Perfect. We'll get in there. Let's take our temporary daughter back to her mother. She's not our temporary daughter. Look, if it makes you feel better, I could be the mum. I've got no problem with that. Just shut up and drive, would you? I need to turn that kid music back on. You have six sense of humour. What? I didn't say anything. Not you, her in the back. Look at her. She's playing with a bloody police car while we're on our way to the police station to risk being arrested. <laughs> of course you'd find that funny. Just remember, a minute ago, I was willing to ditch you and this car and leave as a free man. We could still do that, you know. Josh! I'm so joking. She doesn't understand what we're saying anyway. That's not the point. Stop being a baby. I'm not being a... Shut up. Right, you better run fast. She's just a baby, she probably can't even walk yet. Very funny. I mean it, run fast. Such little faith in me. I'll have you know, in school I have the record for 200 metres. Really? That is surprising. <laughs> yeah, slowest person to run it ever. Brilliant. Even the baby can recognise a joker better than you. I'm not 